let's install Office 2024 in the beta. Now, I've got the link here to the download, which I'll put in the comments section. And I'm going to download the Office tool. I'll go ahead and accept the licensing terms and click Continue. And I've created a folder called Office 2024. And I'll choose to install it there. And now you can see the files were extracted. I'll go ahead and double click on my Office 2024 folder. Now that we've downloaded the setup.exe file along with the configuration files, I'm going to need to edit one of the configuration files so that way it installs 2024 because 2024 is not one of the XML files that got downloaded, but we can fix that. So I'm just going to edit one of the files just by right clicking on it and choosing open with and I'll choose notepad. Now I'm going to go ahead and select all and I'm going to delete it all. And I'm going to replace it with what Microsoft recommends. And I'll paste this in the comment section for you as well. So here we have the Office Edition is going to be 2024. And now I'm going to paste in the keys for each of these three areas, which once again, I'll provide to you. And these come right from Microsoft. So I'm not making these keys up. You don't have to pay for them. They are all included. And according to the Microsoft article I read, this 2024 uh, beta version is going to be good for up to five years. But Microsoft does change their mind on a lot of things. All right, so this is the one I'm going to use. And I'm going to... And I'm going to choose File, Save, and then I'll go ahead and close. And here's the command that we need to use, setup.exe slash configure, followed by the name of the XML file that I just edited. Now here you can see that you may need to uninstall previous versions of Microsoft Office, which I'll go ahead and do, and then I'll run this again. And you can simply uninstall these just by going into Control Panel, Programs and Features, Highlight Office and whatever other program it told you to uninstall, and then choose to uninstall, and then we'll go back to the original spot. Keep in mind when you uninstall your version of Office, you install this beta version, that you might end up causing yourself some problems. You might have to reconfigure everything. You might run into some bugs. So I definitely recommend you do this, say, on a virtual machine or just some sandbox device that is not in production. After the offending programs have been removed, I can go ahead and run it once again. And now it should install 2024. Of course, it might take some time to get it all downloaded. And now we can see the file is getting downloaded. And it depends on the speed of your computer, the speed of your internet connection. In my experience, I have a pretty good connection and a pretty fast computer. And it takes roughly 20 minutes. And it now says my Microsoft 365 Office apps are installed. So I can go ahead and use them. When I open up Control Panel, Programs and Features, I can now see Microsoft Office, Long-Term Servicing, Release uh, 2024. So let's go ahead and open it up for the first time. I'll go down to the Start menu and open up Word. And I'll choose to create a new blank document. I went ahead and launched Visio as well, and you can see that it is the 2024 preview. If I click on Home, then we can see how we can go ahead and create a basic diagram in the 2024 version. And here it is. And I'll do some upcoming videos on Word, Excel, and all the other different products in the Office 2024 suite. And that is how we install the beta version of Office 2024 on a Windows 11 computer.